What's up everybody, Waddle Gaming here, and welcome back to more Fallout 4 Survival Mode. Today we are going to head into the Four Leaf Fish Placking Plant to do two things, I believe. We're going to go into General Atomics to do the Automaton Quest, and we're going to head out to... Uh, what's that place called? Uh, I forget, but we're going to go out to set up Mercer Safe House and also to do the uh, Jamaica Plane Quest, that's the name of it. But first, there are some ghouls in my way that I want to make go pop. And that did not kill him. It's been a while since I played this, so... I'm not expecting this to go completely well. And I'm going to get flanked from both sides here in a second if I don't start moving. You're hearing stuff. Well, good on you. I think it's time to get rid of a few ferals. Get rid of you. Someone there. Nope, nope. Uh, uh oh, I hear a suicider. I hear a lot of bad things. And most of- Oh, most of them are ghouls. Oh god, the old screen just shook. You can die. You can die. I am getting shot like hell at the moment. Might actually keep that place for later, because that's definitely somewhere I might see myself going just to clear out, just so I have a road. I don't know if that was the end of the ferals or not. I think that's the end of the ferals down here. We've got the four leaf fish packing plant. If I can get up on here, can I? And I don't think I can get up. So do I have anything in my inventory which would put me, I don't know, in a good way to open this thing up? It appears that I don't have crap. Ah, okay. It looks like I'm just gonna be doing this just by eyes and ears. So, maybe this one? Yeah. Oh, I, I stuffed that up. Or did I? And then do this one. Is the next one up on the roof? So I can remember a little bit about this, but I can't remember exactly what order they're in. Also, I'm being detected. That's This is a great way to start this off. Oh yeah, I hear a ghoul. It's only a basic, and that's a Roma. Well, wait, do they not even see me? Apparently they haven't seen me. Well, this works for me. And what are you, my dear sir? You're a Reaver. So you can go down. There we go. And another one. Come on, where's the legendary? I know there's one up here. There's gotta be a legendary up here. And I also just got some military grade duct tape. Radex and a straw pillow. Kickball I probably shouldn't have taken, but... Okay. We've also got a fusion core in here, although I'm not going to bloody take it. Since those things are that heavy, it's not funny. What else we got around here? Ah, we've got stage one of my plan today. Place Mila. I believe I pulled that out of my ass, but, you know. It's Fallout's Fallout, I guess. Whenever you want something, you just pull it out of your ass and plant it down. I'm actually quite disappointed. There's, uh, there's an expert lock safe up here. There's no legendaries. Come on. There we go. Yes. 45 caliber. Of, ooh, 50 caliber. And I'll take all that. Wait. So, is there an... Ah. There is another one up here. So if I was to do, uh, this... 
No, I don't think that worked. Okay, I've managed to thin it down to one more. So we're about to see if all this hard work pays off. There we go. Who needs a, pe a scrawny piece of paper? Can't break the code. I wouldn't have been able to unlock it anyway. So let's head into Morowski's chem lab. We've been making the rounds. Real job. It's time you learn the big secret. Now that's just annoying. What the? Hello, chem lab workers. You can all die. You're all stupid level ones. Level ones that can actually shoot quite heavily. I don't think we're alone. We've been making the rounds, doing the job. It's time you learn the big secret. Everyone thinks that Desdemona is the big boss. She calls the ops, gives the rah-rah speeches, but it's just an act. She does what I tell her to because the railroad, it's my show. It's been that way since I founded it. You're lying. Do you really think I'm gonna fall for this? Fall for what? Haven't you noticed that when I say the word Desdemona does a 180? Hey, there's an intruder! No, I vouch for him. Then welcome! Every time. It works best that way. Gives me room to maneuver. We've come a long way since the beginning. We've done a lot of good. Saved a lot of synths. But we're about more than that. We are the last and only line of defense between the Institute and the Commonwealth. Hell, maybe even the world. No, stop me, you're lying. You've lied to me at least once. This is just more of the same. Yeah, you got me. But you're gonna hear the same sort of lies elsewhere. There's other organizations out there, and in time, I'm sure they're gonna spoon-feed you their own patented form of bullshit. Ignore the verbiage and look at what they're doing. What they're asking you to do. What sort of world they'd have you build. And how they're gonna pay for it. Railroad steal, no more lies. Yeah, give me an assessment of everybody else. So what do you think of the other groups out there? Love the job you're doing with the Minutemen. Historically, they've been little better than policemen, though. The Brotherhood. Well, I met them on an op in Capital Wasteland a few years back. But now with Elder Maxon, let's just say... Not a fan. And the Institute? Well, do I really need to answer that? But what I think doesn't matter. The real question is, what do you think? And... At the end of the day, you'll need to make a choice. Make it the right one. That's solid advice right there. But ultimately pointless. I don't know if even a scaver would take that. Yeah, but I'm not a scaver and, you know, I kind of need this stuff because I don't know what stuff goes with, goes with what anymore because I haven't played this game in a very long time. Why are you creeping? Uh, do I need a hazmat suit? Sure, I'll take one. I should have left that on him. Oh, God. Okay, what else? I'm just going to quickly loot this place. Okay, nothing real good in here. There's not really a large amount of chems. Although I don't know why it is considered to be a chem lab. We'll take all that precious pre-war money, though. Our next stage now is... Wait, was there was a sleeping bag around here, right? No, even better. A dirty mattress. Just dropped two hours of sleep in. And now with that done, let's go clean out the rest of this. Terminal somewhere. As soon as I open the door. And we're now out into the main fish packing plant itself. And I think I just Thanks, upset... I, really need this feedback. I think I just upset a ghoul. Although I have no clue where he's going. I hear him, but I don't see him. Nope, apparently he's lost interest. Fine. So let's quickly clear this place out, and then we'll be moving straight on. Oh, hello. That's not something I wanted to see in my face. You have a resolute automatic combat shotgun. Time slows down for a moment when chambering the final round. Yeah... I don't really go down to, like, the final round in a shotgun. I usually reload it way before then. Ooh. And it's an ice-cold Nuka-Cola Quantum. Make it even better. Deacon has apparently fallen off. 
And yet he's climbed back up here anyway. I think he may have just upset a whole bunch of ghouls. I heard something. Yes, Deacon, you would have heard something because you're the idiot that woke them up. Ow! God, I hate it when... Wait, am I stuck? What the hell was that? Okay, while well, Deacon's fighting these things, this looks like a perfect time to open a, uh... Open a toolkit up. That's it. Yeah, got some more rounds. Yeah, so this is happening. Okay, time to get the combat shotgun out since Deacon's decided he wants to... Deacon, he he's... Left anything useful for us. He was right there in front of you. Stopped using a sniper for everything. This is the wrong game for that. Coolant. I'll take some coolant. Ah! Really? Actually, don't go down on the bottom level. Let's instead take this area up here. I might be able to sneak up on some more ghouls. Deacon just can't stop falling from places. You're a Roma. You're now a dead Roma. Uh-oh, I've woken somebody else up. Another kickball that I probably shouldn't have taken. But never mind. Um... There was nothing on that ghoul to pickpocket. But, never mind, eh? If Deacon's done with... Ooh, hello. Uh-oh. I hear the... I hear noises. Where the hell are they? Oh, there you are! Too bad you never made it up the stairs, you dumbass. I wonder how you get over to there. Hang on a second. If I was to come over to here. And jump and jump. I found a secret. I think. This is probably going to be generic stuff, but... Yep. I got a mine, though. And we'll go... I think I may have injured one of them, I'm not particularly certain. Where are you? Man. Now that we've opened that door, we'll activate the Protectron that was in there. And we'll also crack open the security door. Protectron on duty. Ah, it's a good old utility one too. I think he has the inbuilt nail guns, or rail guns. I think they're nail guns. Now that he's active, I shouldn't be attacked that easily. There's nothing else in here. I've already fixed that. So now that he's active, I think we have a better chance of going down into this area. Down here. Right after I collect all the trays in the world. There is a door down here, but whether or not I want to go through it is another question. I think we might just leave that door alone. Wait, where'd Protectron... Oh, Protectron's useless. He's only standing in that one area. Okay, never mind. I guess I'm doing this myself and... Oh. Okay. Just, uh... Thanks, I really need this feedback. Here you go. Have a grenade. Have another one. Oh, there's a gangrenous, a gangrenous, and a rotting together. Although none of them can now touch me. Really? So close. I've literally just crippled all of them. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. And is that it? I think that's it. Well, that was. So much easier than what I thought it was going to be. Why is this game all easy all of a sudden? I was expecting this to get my ass kicked. Ooh, a bobby pin box. Yes, please. Anybody else around here? Anybody at all? 
Nope, that was literally it. Apart from a steamer trunk. Ooh, a plasma grenade and a pulse mine. And the other stuff's not even worth it. Yeah, there's nothing really else in here except from a dead guy who apparently liked putting skulls in a urinal. But we don't need a judge. Ah, Tales of a Junktown Jerky Vendor here. I'll definitely grab that. And I think that was all that was it for this section here. Yes? No? Maybe? And... Yep, that was it. I'm gonna get out of here now. Oh, now who looks who decides to show up? Well, aren't you just an idiot? Oh. I didn't see this here before. What is in here? Probably just generic stuff like normal. Ah, fine, I'll take all of that. And there's nothing else. Alright, back outside now, and before I go do General Atomics... Um, no, that's the wrong button. Actually, I do have a level up I could take. What do I want to put this point into? I could do Ninja. Um, I might actually put it into Strong Back. I could use the extra carrying, per carrying capacity. And that's it for that one, I don't want the rest. So what does that bring my carry weight? Ooh, 350. Before I go back to General Atomics, I have to go drop some stuff off. Stuff off back at the castle. But even before I do that, I think I might actually... You might want to wipe the blood off anything you find there. I might actually go clear this place out. Because this is going to be an annoying little place that they're going to start shooting at me whenever I go past and... Because I gotta go to the castle a couple of times ah, over, I better take this out now I'll rather than later. Ah. Well, there goes one. Switch over to Righteous Authority. And what do you have? Oh, never mind, you're gonna die anyway. Ah, uh, that. And you're dead, and I think that's this entire area done. Maybe? Yep, it definitely is. And I still didn't get a legendary out of it. Which is a bit disappointing. You usually expect there to be at least a legendary on dopper here. But never mind. So, just... Oh, just jump. There we go. Speaking of which, I think I better eat something before I die. Uh, sure, take a couple of them. So now, next. What have we got to do next? Uh, General Atomics is next, I think. Uh, how much carrying capacity have I got? Yeah, I might actually make a quick run back to the castle and then I'll be outside General Atomics. Okay, next up on our list is General Atomics, so we can start uh, continue the uh, Automaton quest. So I just went back and got some extra uh, water and dropped off some weaponry, so I should be fine. Got fun time incoming. That was probably a bad idea, but let's go with it. Come on, where is everybody? There you are. And they've already crippled my head. Oh, this this is automatically starting off well. And can I get a lock on it? There we go. Alright, who else is shooting at me? You! You can die. 
Anybody? Oh, there's still more yet. Take you out. There we go. So who else is left? We've got a receptionist terminal that I didn't really want to go into, but whatever. Uh, I'm not going to bother doing all that. we still got more yet, because I can hear them in the distance. I can hear something. You almost got away. Oh, hello. Yep, you can die by death by legs. And there goes one of the legs, I think. Please don't tell me you're going to blow up. It would be nice if you didn't. Okay, good. Getting plenty of stuff out of this, but we'll see what happens when I get closer to the main boss of this area. What's in here, by the way? Oh, this is just toilets. Is there any traps? No, there is some buff out and some money. And Deacon's trying to glitch that gun through my head again. We have an expert lock door here. I wonder what's behind it if I can get this thing open. There we go. Nice. Okay, that leads out to an office. Hopefully there's nothing out here. Okay, doesn't look like it. So what do we got in here? Ah, the General Atomics ID card. I'm definitely going to need that. And Kincaid's terminal, personal logs. Uh, that's just a bit of lore. You can pause that bit that I uh, that I pulled up if you want to read it, but it's nothing really too interesting. Cool. Creepy ass child there. Okay. Ah, Tesla science. Yes. Energy weapons permanently inflict 5% damage. I'm through. What's fr we're getting through this door now. And Deacon liked that apparently. Now who else is down here that I could possibly murder? Still haven't found... Oop. There's someone down here. Someone that's now dead and I'm immediately into caution. There goes another one. It's also a footlocker here. I won't. S oh, hello! Hello! Come on, take it out. Okay, just run back this way for a second. I'm just about to die. Nuka Cola Quantum, don't fail me now. And I've got a arm um, that I need to stim pack. Fine. I've got enough water for that now. And I'm dead. Because apparently I got sniped. Deacon, really? Can you get out of my way, please? I've got people to hit. Good dodge, man. So I just entered back into here, doing my usual kill everything. And apparently... Oh, hang on. I think we've got another one. Apparently, in this area now, I, ha I have a legendary. Because apparently that spawned in. He has a vat- ooh. A vats enhanced combat shotgun. Improve vats hit chance, ooh. That might actually be good to have a look I at later. Battle cry. And there's another one coming in, so you're gonna die now. Okay, instead of opening that door again and getting my ass kicked, I'm just gonna go ahead and take out these lot. There we go. Get rid of that one. Oh, I think someone's a bit pissed at me. Ah, uh, okay, this is the way to the Robo Brain. Um, 
Can I just skip past this? No, I don't want the fusion core, but I will take everything else. Okay, just skip past this. Oh, hello! And I'm dead again! And I've also stuck my ass through a floor, which I didn't even know was possible. Okay, I finally made it back up to where I was. Minus a uh, legendary this time, so I didn't get that shotgun, which is a disappointment. Now, to finally get rid of that annoying voice. And oh, security's too tight. Yep, I see you down there. There you go. Have a grenade. Have another grenade. And another one. Okay, I got rid of that annoying voice at least. I was hoping they'd all be dead by now. Uh oh. Yeah, and down goes the Robo Brain. But I think there is still another robot down there, though. Lost him. So that's how it feels. Is there someone else down there? Yes, there is. Yeah, so this is happening. And down goes the last robot. And now with all that over, all we have to do is just crack open the security doors. There's that annoying, whoa, 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 what's going on? Why am I ha ha taking so many rads? Okay, I'm taking rads here for some reason. If it gets any worse, I'll put a hazmat suit on. But we got rid of him. And I swore there was a bobblehead here, but never mind. Wait, there's a radio around here, but I'm not going to bother with it. We're going to pick up the mechanist device. And, ooh, two, mil two millimeter cartridges. Uh, if only I had a gauze rifle. So with all that done now, the last thing we have to do in here is just quickly go through the QA department. It's a fun little side area. Greetings, Unit 761. Welcome to the General Atomics Quality Assurance Department, where we assure your functionality is up to our high standards. We must run a few tests before returning you to your caregiving duties. Now please, proceed into the first test chamber. Okay. First, we must test and your disciplinary and behavioral are management skills. Garbage in, garbage out. Quality Assurance Associate will be playing the role of your hypothetical charge, little Timmy. Little Timmy has broken a valuable vase while playing catch in the house. The vase was a family heirloom, and it is quite irreplaceable. Please, punish the child accordingly. Fantastic! The appropriate punishment was separation of the child from any potential source of entertainment. And please remember, corporal punishment is strictly forbidden unless the user enables it in your configuration mode. Please proceed into the second test chamber. I don't think little Timmy so much needs to be uh needs to be punished anymore. Not entirely sure how old this is, but I think little Timmy's been sitting there a little bit too long. A proper Mismani unit must be able to identify the needs of our charges. Please assess the state of the crying child and fulfill its needs. Wah! What the hell? The hell? Wah, wah. Are you serious? Wah, wah. Oh my god, that sounds... Wah. Here! Wah. Correct. The child was angry. Your vocal tonality analysis programming seems to be in working order. Please take this opportunity to reconfirm that any deprecated muffling procedures are not left in your programming. Now please, Proceed into the third testing chamber. Righto, Fallout, now I've seen everything. 
I could actually store stuff in the test baby. That's how far this goes. What have we got last? We will now test your hazard detection matrices. Please child proof this environment by moving any hazardous object to where little ants cannot reach. Child proof the room. Child proof the room. Okay, that drinking glass needs to go. These uh these plates definitely are dangerous. That pen in the dumpster. Yeah, let's get rid of all this. That machete does not belong there, so we'll just stick that up on here. And yep. What else we got? Yep, that shopping basket is a choking hazard, as so that oven mitt. And Yep, that saucer and cup is. These things definitely are. That giddy up buttercup definitely needs to go. These are Please blocks. Any potential tool of self -arm. Those blocks are definitely like a choking hazard. Yeah, all this and this can go as well. And that wrench can go as well. And is that all I have to get or do I have to take... Wait. Where'd that machete go? What the hell? Is this the famous floating machete, is it? I'm pretty sure I've done everything. I am trying to, but apparently the machete is glitched out. What about if I chuck a grenade in there? Will that do? I heard it. I heard that machete go. There it is. Yep, let's take that and toss it out. Why, why isn't that telling me that's it for? Oh, there we go. Potentially fatal objects have been put out of a child's reach. Please remember, children have a penchant for finding ways to arm themselves. They never are truly safe. Absolute diligence is required. Congratulations. It appears you are fully functional and ready to return to service. Please take a replacement fusion core from the safe in the hallway on your way out. Gladly. All I had to do was pick up that machete and I would have had it. Uh, I will take that, but I will leave the fusion cores. Righto, back to the castle again. Alright, last thing I want to do today, because this part's been running way longer than what I wanted, originally intended it to, instead of going... Instead of going to uh, Mercer Safe House and getting the treasures of Jamaica Plain, we're just going to head out there today. Or at least I hope I am, if I can navigate through these streets. I'm just going to head out there, and the next part I will do that and a bunch of other things, because I don't really plan these things out. Oh, hello. Oh, that's a tank bot. Um, I don't have anything to take that out with, do I? Nope, I'm just gonna just really just crouch and try and not get murdered by those guys. Now, wait, did I... I think I've cleared this place out, so I should be right. If not, I'm about to... Nope, I'm about... I'm about to get horribly murdered. I'm about to get horribly, horribly murdered. Okay, this is not what I expected I'd need to do. Okay, that got got rid of one, but I don't know if that's going to attract the other attention to me. And there's also a legendary raider in here to make things a little bit more interesting. Um, okay. Yeah, sure you won't, Deacon. Uh, can I get a lock on your... I can. But the problem is, I'm so dangerously low on health. We'll chuck that in, whether or not that's going to do anything. If I can get rid of that legendary... Okay, that... Oh, hello. Um, I think the... Ta Okay, things have become slightly more complicated now. I think the uh, the tank bots just joined the battle. 
So this is a popular spot for my Nuka Grenade. Now what did that do? It got rid of everything but the tank bot. Uh, okay, I don't have really anything I can use for this. And the legendary is still alive as well. Um, dump it all in, see what happens. Critical. Oh, that's doing... This is doing absolutely nothing. This is the part where you're supposed to... Actually, this actually works for me. Because he's going after the legendary, and if I can put a grenade or two... Okay, that works slightly. I think I might be able to take it out. Bad time to reload again. Okay, he's still going after raiders. So I'll just wait until... Uh, is it going to take care of it? Take care of that, and then take care of you. And you go down. And big, massive explosion and all that. And I think, are uh, we, are we done? That's, that's the question I need to ask myself. Also, where is that, where was that legendary? Where'd he go? Uh, legendary... Bolstering Simp Left Arm. It hasn't got the best legendary effect, but ooh. It is slightly sturdy gear. Hang on, what have I got on my left arm? Left arm champ. Uh, yeah, I, I can't really can't really do it just for having the extra um, damage resistance for getting rid of a point of strength. Nah, sorry. Okay, we'll take all that, and I am getting out of here before more of them show up. I think I finally took out that legendary that was giving me grief, and there is a death claw down there. Well, this day's just getting better and better, isn't it? Can I find out what level you are, at least? You're an alpha. Um, should I, shouldn't I? Sure, let's go for it. That was obviously a bad idea, but this is what Insert I've got all those frag mines for. Involving death and your inevitable doom here. Okay, run. Run back. And... why well, he, uh, He's attacking Deacon. I can get a few shots in myself. And... Uh-oh! Nope, that didn't work, that didn't work, that didn't work, it didn't work. Oh, I'm so dead. I can hear him literally behind me. Hopefully he can't get in here. Can he? No, yes. I don't think he can get in here. Um, hello. Oh. Well, this works for me. This works for me. If they, those two are going to attack each other, I can just drop a grenade right in the middle of them. And now the legendary... You know what? This was a, this was a very bad idea. Hi there, you big dumb thing. Hi. Can you take a few shots to the head? Oh yeah, he's going to go down very quickly. And that's the end of those. Seriously. The one weapon I get instigating on happens to be a board. Oh, game, you know when the troll people, don't you? And that... Deathclaw is glitching the hell out, so I'm just not going to bother with that. I need to go back and pick up Deacon again. Since I may have been involved in crippling him. 
I hate lurks. Piercing their shells a bitch. Let me tell you. You don't say, Deacon. That's why you use a shotgun for. You can't be using snipers for everything, you know? It's not that type of game. I'm in caution, but they didn't see me. So if I can get a nice angle on them, I should win this fight. Get rid of you. How many of them is there in there? I'm out of grenades too. I think there's only like one more. At least I hope so. Nothing there now. Yep, yep, nothing there now. Die. I think that was it for them. Yep, that was it. So I'll gladly take all your stuff off you. Oh, some grenades. Or at least I hope they were. I picked them up too fast to read it. And the best part is... Ooh. Tactical 50 caliber. Damn. The best part is I can sleep. So all my progress didn't go to waste. Okay, how far is Jamaica Plains off? Jamaica Plains is just down there. So you know what? I'm going to leave this part here. Tomorrow, next part, I should probably say, we're going to head down Jamaica Plains, do the treasures, uh, establish the safe house, and is that the only thing that I have to do? Yep, that's all I have to do. So drop a like, leave a comment, subscribe for more to come, and I shall see you all in the next video.